What's good YouTube? It's your boy Tay here with a video on how to get curly hair for black men. I'm not used to looking at this video like I got nappy hair. Whoop de whoop de whoop. I can't get curly hair. Boom! You can get curly hair, bruh, and I'm gonna show you how. Y'all stay tuned and make sure y'all subscribe and like to the channel, man, where I'll be dropping videos and heat on the daily for y'all. Alright, man, let's get it. I'm gonna show y'all four things to use to get curly hair, bruh. I know some people are like, I gotta use this product. I gotta use this product. You don't need that. You don't need this. You don't need that. You don't need this. You don't need that. Okay, I'm gonna show y'all four things that y'all need, bruh. All I be using to get my hair curly is first of all, wash your hair. Don't be trying to get curly hair with dirty hair. First of all, that's nasty, okay? Who raised you? All right, bro, for my shampoo, I use Cantu Shea Butter Moisturizing Cream Shampoo. Okay, best thing on the market, all right? Focusing on that, all right? And then for my conditioner, after you shampoo your hair, condition your hair, okay? Because you can shampoo your hair, and after you shampoo it, it's gonna be dry as crap. You're gonna have a Sahara Desert sit on top of your forehead, okay? So don't do that. So to condition it, I use the Cleansing Cream Shampoo, whatever like that. You know what I'm saying? To condition it or whatever, you know, I use that. Okay? So, moisturizer, okay? And conditioner. These two to wash your hair. So what I do is I wash my hair about two times with the with the shampoo. I know I got that back, but whatever. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I wash my hair twice with the shampoo, okay? And then after I do that twice. I use the moisturizer and let that sit in my hair for about like, you know, like two minutes or whatever, like get in the shower wise, you know, rub a dub dub or whatever like that. So then after I get out of the shower or whatever like that, dry my hair off, um, but keep it damp a little bit, whatever like that. Then I put in S curl texturizer back in the day stuff. Like my granddaddy uses stuff. That's how he got real curly. I use that right there. All right. And then this is like a product that I got from Target or whatever like that. So I just throw some, it's called Uncle Jimmy. Uncle Jimmy's like an old player with curly hair. So I use some of that and that works like cake. So I'm gonna go through a routine of what I do. Um, and y'all do whatever works for y'all, bro. This is just what I do. You know, I got the nappy hair going on, you know what I'm saying? So just watch how I do it and let me know if it helped y'all in the comments. All right, y'all, make sure y'all got a towel handy also. You don't want to be washing your hair and soap and stuff getting on your eyes. That hurts. All right, and then after you wet your hair, make sure you pick your hair up so you can get deep, deep in your scalp, you know, to get all the shampoo and the moisturizer inside your scalp. All right, we're going to get into how I wash my hair, and then we're going to go into how I curl my hair, all right?
All right, y'all. This stuff right here, we're gonna let sit for two minutes, the moisturizer, okay? All right, so we'll be back. All right, y'all, been about two, three minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it out. All right, y'all, that is my washing method. All right, so let's get to the styling method. All right, y'all, we just finished the washing method. Uh, my hair is still kind of damp. I didn't like completely dry my hair because I like putting stuff in my hair when it's still kind of wet or whatever like that. Pat it a little bit, pat it, you know what I'm saying? So, so I can tell, none right now. So we're gonna start with, I'm gonna start with the S curl first. We're gonna put the S curl in. Um, and I don't put much, I put like a quarter size. So maybe like, not even a lot or whatever. Like I might put like that much. And what I do is put in my palms, rub together, hit the bird man on them. You know what I'm saying? Hit the bird man a couple times, just to get it nice and, nice and moist in your hands. And I just go in the um, kind of crazy pattern, you know, cause you want your curls to be everywhere. And we we'll in one direction, whatever like that. And put as much as you want to to your liking. You know, if it's not enough curls, then put some more. You know, whatever like that. All right. So then after that, I go to the curl kicker. Put some of that same weight. Um, I don't put a lot of this in. So I put it like quarter size. You know, so you want to get it all in, all in your roots, or whatever like that. Y'all can tell they're starting to come a little bit, you know. So, all right. So then after that, you good to go. If you want to add like a little curl sponge in, you know, giving that definition. You know, give So at your own risk, don't be going around here thinking you 360 Jeezy or, or whatever, think you can shape yourself up, okay? I've been cutting hair for a while. I'm not a barber, but I know how to edge myself up. After you do your curl or whatever, like you can give yourself a quick edge up or whatever like that. You know, I got the, the Andy, something simple, just to edge myself up quick, all right? All right, y'all, that concludes today's video. If this video helps you in any type of way, please subscribe and like my page, man, where I'll be dropping videos on the daily of uh, just different things, man. And we're also doing a, a thousand subscriber giveaway. So make sure y'all subscribe, bro. We gone.